Okay, good morning everyone. Okay, today I want to review uh, product Honeywell uh, SensePoint XCD. This one for gas detection. So this one the part of code number, and then made in Korea. And then I also have uh, order Honeywell SensePoint for LEL detection uh, separate separate uh, sensor from controller so we got the this one this one for sensor we install at uh, site location you want to detect so something like this you got a black box and you have a cable gland for insert the wire and then you got a CD, a manual CD from Honeywell. You must read the instruction manual first before you do the installation. Okay. So this one Honeywell controller. Why you let we see what we get inside. Okay, you got the you got the instruction manual. So I order part is XCD RFD. So I got the Allen key and uh, magnet key. We also have um, certificate inspection test from Honeywell. And then we got the, huh, the controller one. So here. The yellow color. We have a cable gland M22 and N20. So you can insert the cable. Okay, I okay I have done do the wiring. So here we got the terminal block. So you have a power terminal block. And then you also have a connection from sensor to your controller. So this one for relay alarm. And then we also have a 4 to 20 output. How to start up? So you must have a power supply. So I got the power supply from Mimbuel 24VDC. 20, and then I also have a calibration gas for 50% LEL ok first you must do the power cable 24 volt positive is um, positive positive terminal 1 and negative is terminal 2 so terminal 16, 17 and 18 you connect here so this one you must read the instruction manual ok I have a hose for do the detection gas ok I, I want to start up the controller so you can see here the front page so test controller this one you can follow the instruction manual for the test controller ok this one we also got the gas detection 100 LEL and span is 15 sorry 50 ok after you done um, power up, you must wait until six. Uh, sorry, uh, one minute. One minute for warm up.
Okay, done. So, current. Uh, so, uh, if you got like this, so the sensor connection sense connection sensor and controller have done. So you see something like this. Let's say you got the alarm when you start up, when you warm up, and then you got alarm. You got the alarm trigger. You must do the A zero first or calibration zero point. So I can I want to show to you how you want how you want how you can do the calibration and setting alarm. So you got the key from Honeywell key magnet button. So you push here anti uh, you see that button so you got the first page is set calibration so if you want to do the zero calibration you touch here and then this one sensor start do the air zero so if Page something like this. You near done. Okay. So when the stable zero, you touch the this one, right button. Zero pass. If show um, zero fail means you must do until get up, get the result pass. So if you want to do the span, you must have a calibration calibration gas so now I, I I don't want to do so you can skip uh, no button sorry uh, spend no and right okay we see, we can see the next page okay uh, sec, uh, sense uh, gas set range so this one range is 0 to 100 if you want to set range you can you can you can touch this button up and down so my detection is 100 so i go to next page next page next page next page test bump you can do the test bump if you have a span and zero gas okay this one for set alarm normally you can get from supplier uh, first alarm is 20 and second alarm is 14 so if we want to set the alarm we can touch right button and you can chain let's say I want to do 20 okay you see I start my first alarm is 20 so you can push the right button then push the right button so alarm my second alarm is 25 so okay set alarm is done so you can set the relay you can set the relay set lock if you want lock this one you need uh, for temperature test alarm if you want to you want to do the test alarm so if you want to try the test alarm you can push here okay first, first alarm 
Okay, I force first alarm. You can see relay trigger, and then the blinking. When you when you when you see the uh, red color blinking, means uh, alarm. Means controller show the alarm. Something wrong with your sensor. Okay, test alarm done. So if you want to set ID, you can set the ID. And then quick. Okay. So I want to try inject the spent gas 550 LEL percent so you can see here and then you can see my host connection my host and I can show you when it alarm trigger LEL 50 So first alarm trigger and second alarm trigger. Okay, set the controller time. 